In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to set a passcode on your Google Drive, Docs and Sheets files. This is an essential step if you want to add an extra layer of security to your valuable documents and data. Let's dive right into it. First, you'll need to go to Google Forms, open your browser and type in Google Forms in the search bar and hit enter. Once you're on the Google Forms page, click on the option to start a blank form. This will give you a fresh canvas to work with. Next, you'll need to give your form a name. Click on the default title area and rename it to something like Access Passcode Verification. This will make it clear that this form is intended to require a passcode for access. Now, change the question from Untitled Question to What is the Password? This is where the individual will input the password you've set. Select Multiple Choice as the question type and then switch it from Multiple Choice to Short Answer. This ensures that the person responding will enter text rather than selecting from various options. To make the question mandatory, toggle the required button. This ensures that the password question must be answered before submitting the form. Next, click on the three vertical dots on the bottom right of the question box. This opens up additional settings. Among those options, select Response Validation. You'll now configure the settings for the response validation. Change the validation to require text and type the exact password that you want to set up for access. Make sure it is something secure and hard to guess, but memorable for you or whoever needs access. Now you can go ahead and set up a custom error message. This message will be displayed when the wrong password is entered. Something like incorrect password, please try again, can work well. This setting helps clearly guide the user when they enter the wrong password, providing them another chance to input the correct one. The next step requires you to navigate to your Google Drive. Open a new tab and head to Google Drive. Once there, locate and select the file you wish to protect with the passcode. Click the share button in your drive. You need to adjust the sharing settings, so go ahead and switch it to anyone with the link. After doing this, click copy link. This copied link will be embedded into your Google form, directing users to your document upon successfully entering the passcode. Return to the Google form, locate the settings option and click on it. Under the presentation section, click on edit next to the confirmation message. Here you'll paste the link you just copied from Google Drive. Remember to click the save button after making these changes to ensure everything is locked in place. Finally, click on the preview button. This allows you to see how others will interact with your form, test it out by entering the password you've set. If everything is working correctly, it should redirect you to the file in Google Drive. And there you have it, your document is now securely protected with a passcode. Be sure to share the form's link with those who need access, ensuring they are aware of the passcode. This method keeps your documents secure and allows only those with the correct passcode to access them. Thank you for watching, and make sure to check out our other videos for more helpful tips and tricks.